Hey everyone, it's Erica and it's April 27th and I have this right here. It's my Dendrobium sorciflorum. I'm not sure if that's the right way to pronounce it, but it's a species Dendrobium orchid and look what we have here. Um, two little inflorescence forming. So I purchased this inf bud um, and I got a nice set of flowers and this is several months later and it's starting to form new ones. So again, there's two growing and each one will be like a cluster of flowers. So it's not a single one. And as you can see, it gets a lot of light. So this is my south facing window and it does point a tiny bit west. Um, so it's pretty bright in the winter and actually the leaves just came out like this week. Um, I feel like this year it's later than previous years. I think um, it's been dark and rainy, so it's a lot cooler this year so far. But I'm super excited, and I'm not sure if you can see. Okay, you can definitely see now. There's like um, little bits of sap on the orchid uh, and fluorescence. Not sure why orchids produce the sap, but I see this on um, a lot of orchids I have, and yeah, the, all these, a little bit of lighting, plants are sitting in this window, um, they get decent amount of lights, but now it's, um, the trees leafing outside, it still gets bright light, but not as bright as in the winter time, so yeah, I'll give an update once these flowers um, start to progress. Thanks for watching! Morning guys, it's May 11th and look at this. Looks like there's going to be a lot of buds. So excited and of course there's that second one right next to it. Um, it's not as mature yet. And then look, I found this this morning. I'm not sure if I'm going to have a third one. And of course... He likes to play when I'm filming. Hey everyone, um, today is May 16th and look at the progress on this. So the flower spike or inflorescence has elongated and look at this one. The buds are all separated out. Um, this one is just right behind it and I showed you this last time. I do think it's a flower spike. The These ones... Um, kind of look like that when it started off. So I can't wait to see what happens. I'm so, so excited. And uh, yeah, I'll be back. Hello, today is the 18th and just a quick update. Look at how much the buds have separated. It's only been a few days. I wonder how long it'll take to uh, open up. I'll be back. Hello everyone, today is May 19th and the buds have started to open up. So here they are right in the center, which is a little strange because usually they will start opening from the oldest part and then move downwards. But right here it's just like starting at the center. And the one next to it, um, still growing. Look at how many buds there are. I'm really super excited to see this bloom. So I'll be back. Hey, so it's the next morning, so it's the 19th, and look at this. They opened overnight. It's pretty cool. I wonder if um, I'll be able to have both of these inflorescence and bloom at the same time. That would be pretty cool. Good morning. It's the 21st, and all the buds have opened. Look how cute they look. I don't smell a scent yet, but I'll check again later. Hey guys, look at this. Today's the 26th and it's in full bloom. 
I don't know about you guys, but I think it's this is really impressive. Imagine if you had a gigantic one with these inflorescence all over. This is just a tiny division from a larger plant. And I love the flowers. So the older one on the right, you can see it's like a deep, rich, yellow gold color. The ones on the left are newer, so they're lighter, but they'll darken up over time. And can you see the fuzziness in the lip? They're super fuzzy. So I did a time lapse and I started it on Thursday night with my cell phone. Today is Sunday morning. I don't think I've ever been that long without my cell phone. It kind of felt really weird, especially when going out without my phone. Um, have you guys been out? I mean, have you guys been that long without a cell phone nowadays? <laughs> but anyways, I'm really happy with the flowers and I'm loving this. Hey guys, so it's quite a while after um, I had gone to on vacation while it was in bloom and after I came back from vacation um, it was already dried up and now the, the dried up flowers have all fallen so um, I keep it outside now and um, hopefully it gets enough light I think I need to repot this because it's um, kind of growing um, sideways and I actually had to put rocks in the pot to keep it from tipping over because it's so top heavy um so that's it for now for this orchid um i love it that little third bump dried up um so it, i didn't get any flowers um, out of that but i'm super happy with those two that i got and uh thanks for watching and happy growing Bye bye